Hi, today we're going to take a look at distance and midpoint formulas. Uh, when we find the distance on a flat area uh, in a linear way, um, let's say just along the x-axis, along the y-axis, uh, distance is fairly easy to count. You're just counting how many steps you go over. So if I want to find the distance from A to B, I can literally just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 count spots. Um, we could also subtract the distances from each other. So I could say 4 minus negative 2, that turns to a plus, giving us 4 plus 2, which is, again, distance of 6. Okay, when you're dealing with just the x, not bad. Uh, it's a little more challenging when you get an angle on a slope, or when you get a line on a slope, and I'm trying to find the distance between those two points. Well, we have a formula to help us out with that. That's up here. This is called the distance formula. We're taking the square root of x, x2 minus x1, square it, and plus y2 minus y1 and square that. Um, so basically, you're taking those four numbers, you're just dropping them into place. Let's label everything first. So you have x comma y, x comma y. Like when dealing with slope and algebra, we labeled them x1, y1, x2, y2. We're doing the same thing here. Now, I want to take those four numbers, just drop them in place. So we are saying... Uh, 4 minus 1 squared plus 5 minus 1 squared. And now we just have to simplify. Uh, 3 squared, 4 squared, 9 and 16, and 25. When we take square root of 25, we get a distance of 5. Cool. From here to here is 5. It would take much longer if I walked up and then over. Now, we've got something called midpoint. Midpoint is the middle of that line. So again, if we go back to our first picture up here, from A to B, what's that middle point? Well, that middle point's going to be at 1. We could say by going 1, 2, 3, or 1, 2, 3. Um, they have an equal distance out. That's it. Or you could find the average of our two points, A and B. I could say 4 plus a negative 2. When I add them together, I get 2. And then I divide by however many items we're talking about. We're talking about two items. Divide by 2. The average of those two coordinates is a 1. I want to find the average down here, but do it twice. Find the average of my x's. Find the average of my y's. So my two x values... It's 1 and 4. So I'm going to say 1 plus 4, divide by 2. And then my y half, I'm going to have 1 plus 5, divide that by 2. Notice that I still have a coordinate that I'm creating here. When we simplify, we get 5 over 2 and 6 over 2. Take that thing one more step, and we've got 2.5 for our x. We have 3 for our y. And there's your midpoint for that bottom picture. And this is using the distance and midpoint formulas.